Get ready for the ride of your life. It's a bold new series that asks the most provocative questions and takes you wherever they lead. Every great journey begins with curiosity. What would happen if you leaned a bit too far over the rim of a volcano and fell in? You would die, of course, but how? The question has garnered more scientific investigation than you might expect. As reported in 2015, lava's high density and resistance to flow suggest a person would smack onto the surface of a lava pit rather than sinking into it. So, instead of dying like Gollum, who dove into a bubbling volcano in the book and film Lord of the Rings, Return of the King, a simple physics analysis indicates you would stay buoyed on top. This wouldn't save you from a gruesome fate, however, resting on a bed of molten rock four times hotter than the broiler in an oven, you'd quickly burst into flames and burn to death. But a newly surfaced video shows that a fallen person might, in fact, be able to penetrate the surface of a lava pit by inroads made by the gases given off by his or her burning flesh. So here's the video. In 2002, the Germany-based volcano researcher Richard Roscoe filmed a 66-pound bag of leftover food and other organic matter being thrown into the volcano. The bag of waste fell 260 feet 80 meters, before striking the surface, and, as seen in the video, it ended up making a dent. As the bag burned, it caused violent outbursts of lava in an effect known as fountaining. It is frequently discussed whether it is possible to sink in lava. Due to its high density, a person would generally be expected to remain on the surface, Roscoe also told Indeed it is possible to briefly walk on certain types of lava if professional heat protective clothing is worn. However, the video shows that falling from a height, a person would be able to penetrate the crust of the lake and submerge in it.